This video describes a simple way to convert two-dimensional patterns into three-dimensional shapes. There are many conventional 2D patterning techniques that are simple, inexpensive, and readily available. For example, screen printing is used to print t-shirts. Roll-to-roll -roll printing and inkjet printing are used to print paper. Photolithography is employed in the manufacture of computer chips. All these methods are inherently two-dimensional, yet they can be used in conjunction with folding to generate 3D shapes. In this process, patterning is employed to define regions on the 2D sheet that will undergo folding. The final 3D shape will be derived from appropriately arranged 2D patterns. A classic example of folding is the ancient Japanese art of origami, which describes folding, ori, of paper, gami. Folding also plays an important role in nature and has found applications in various fields of science and technology. For example, there is protein folding, architecture, textiles, engineering, electronics and communication, industrial design, and remote deployment of satellites and solar sails. A team of researchers at NC State has found a simple approach for converting 2D patterns into 3D objects. The approach is simple and inexpensive. The process requires a pre-strained polymer sheet, which is commercially available. Patterns are drawn on a computer and printed onto the polymer sheet using an ordinary desk jet printer. These sheets can be cut by hand using scissors. The polymer sheets shrink when heated above the glass transition temperature. When we place these sheets under a lamp, the black ink from the printer selectively absorbs the light and converts it into heat locally in the hinge regions. The heat increases the temperature of the sheet under the printed ink. Because black ink absorbs light well, many types of light sources may be utilized, including infrared lamps or halogen bulbs. This video provides visual representation of this thermal process. It shows a cross-sectional view of the sheet. It is apparent the sheet gets warmer starting from the top. The portion of the sheet that does not have ink does not get hot. With time, the temperature in the sheet underneath the ink increases progressively deeper into the sheet, as well as in areas outside the inked regions. When the temperature inside the film exceeds a certain critical value, the stored strain gets released, which causes the sheet to shrink. Because of the geometry of heating, the strain relaxation occurs gradually, starting in the region close to the ink. The sheet folds in the direction towards the heat source. This process is capable of converting a single sheet of polymer into a number of shapes depending on the shape and location of the hinges, as shown in these examples. In summary, this video describes a simple way to convert 2D patterns into 3D shapes using light and inexpensive commercial polymers. This new approach to self-folding is compatible with low-tech 2D patterning techniques as well as soft materials. This method can also be extended to different sources of light and different substrates. The technique may be useful both for low-tech and high-tech applications, including packaging, assembly, electronics, and remote deployment.